When it comes to farming, letting little things slip can derail production for a whole season, and that's why keeping a check on cow health should be a top priority. A particular nasty that's worthy of extra attention is endometritis. Often after calving, there is bacterial infection in the uterus. As the cervix opens for calving, it exposes the cow's reproductive tract to the bugs from the environment. If the infection progresses and the cow develops endometritis, the chances of ovulation and a successful pregnancy are much lower. Traditionally, we've had a bit of a leave it to nature approach to this, with the majority of infections clearing up over three to four ovulations. But any delay like this in a seasonal dairying system ultimately costs us money. Greg is a vet on a mission. Using simple techniques, he's working with farmers to improve in-calf rates and increase the number of early calvers. So Greg, what are you up to today? Yeah, we're out Mitch checking a group of cows from this herd. Um, we will do the rest of the cows later. This is just an early mob to start with. Um, looking for endometritis or pus in the uterus. Um, those that we find today will be treating straight away. So doesn't it come at a cost when it's something that might just cure itself anyway? Yeah, certainly. However, empty cows and cows that get in calf late uh, are also a lot more costly. So um, we try to check them early, treat them early, get rid of those infections early so that they don't linger on, linger on, linger on and cause those cows to conceive later, which ultimately means a better six week in calf rate, which is what every farmer should be chasing. And what's the latest research on endometritis? Yeah, well historically we used to go in about four weeks prior to plans started mating, um, which was good. We treated all the cows that needed treating at the time, but some recent New Zealand research, quite a big study, showed that going in earlier, um, seeing cows before they got to that point right on the start of mating, um, actually found slightly more infections, but it cured those infections a lot better, which ensured a higher six week in calf rate in those animals, about 10%. So, uh, enough of a game to make it very much worthwhile. So we're now advocating for that batch match checking approach. So the motto of today's story, treat dirty cows early and turn dirt into dollars. Watch all our videos by downloading the NZ Farmer Tips app for Apple or Android today.